one of those guys barring injury you expect to play well into his 40s, you know, have another. Swafford has no problem from in front of the green. He's hit that uh, that club twice now on this hole. <laughs> Slight dog leg from right to left. There's a bunker out there. 265 to carry. That's not even in the conversation for him. That's not what he needs to do today. Swafford just inside 200 here. Yeah, after a 305 yard drive first thing in the morning. Yeah, very nice. Got it out there. Oh, and it turned all the way across the hole. Here's Hudson Swafford. He shot a 12 on the ways. We welcome in two-time PGA Tour champ Paul Stankowski. Good morning, sir. Good morning, everybody. 261 for HUD. Feet on the cart path there. Lance, you worried about Obviously, that? he must have liked the lie he had to play it from standing on the cart path. It's never the easy to leave this one short. Oh, that was nicely judged right there, though. Perfection. It's not his first rodeo. Early confidence builder. This year, it starts up the left, trying to get that to work back. Yeah, that's nicely done. Nice and run out there on the fairways as well. Two is looking for a big bounce from 169 there. The front nine for this group. Close to 50 feet here for Swafford. Here it comes. Yeah, Trundling down that hill. It's all about the speed. Oh, that would have been for his third birdie of the morning. It's a bunker out to the right, about 270, trying to keep it short of. Or just blow it by it. Swafford's approach in flight 14. Go. Go. That's got to stay. Oh, oh, after seeing Henley. Swafford two tiered putt from 42 feet here. Tricky putt up the hill, going from left to right and then right to left. Tough to get the speed. And we saw Hud's ball go to down to the to the right. First at the par threes, 184 yard, 15. Down. Really good. And a nice shot in there from Swafford. Yeah, good speed again. First time we've seen uh, water on the golf course today. More of a visual impediment than anything doesn't really come into play from here you're just looking right at the flag landed a foot short one hop up check Zip. right there all right Swafford birdie number three on the day it's not moving it's dead straight don't and this is the last of the par fives that uh, the boys will see today Bunker up the left side is like 330. Really not in play for most. Some guys can get there, but. They win golf tournaments too. Yeah, they're pretty good. Good birdie there from Hudson. Disappointment back at 16, but capitalizes here at 17 and gets to three under. You were saying you'd think you'd rather be in one. Yeah, I mean, the guys, but this is a good lie here. He's got that little ridge. You can see it between he and the hole. It's got to come up, up the slope, and then it's going to trundle down right now. Oh, good play. Yeah, that's nice. Just trying to chip a seven, but tugged it a little. Watch out. 
ball had not gone uh, five yards before he was asking for it to get down. Hudson Swafford in some trouble here. At the 18th, his ninth. Well, that was it. You had to be really aggressive underneath that golf ball to get it go up in the air. And Hudson Swafford at 18. All right, right edge. Yeah, that was left the whole way. Downhill. Left rough is fine, bud. You said the left rough is fine, but right isn't as fine. See, so he started that one left there, doing the safety dance. He's shown some good pace early on the front nine with the flat stick from cross country. He's Good speed there, Fluid, but also aggressive through the hitting area with the putter. I like that. Yeah. Trying to hit that little power fade. Oh, yeah. And when, when you see it go past the camera, folks, that means it's really long. 107 left. All right, oh, well, that's dude. not his best. Got a little quick with that one. Yeah, I love looking at all the different colors, shades of green. Hudson Swafford for Birdie now. Found a green they can read. Three under has the tee. Doesn't need all that driver. But if you have a cannon, shoot it. Yeah. <laughs> Especially if you got to get that kind of a break. No doubt. It's Wofford. Okay. <laughs> you, you and I used to be young too. Look what it did to us. <laughs> yes, I know. Well. Time is undefeated. I don't know if you're aware of that. <laughs> Swafford back at five. Really have to fly this all the way back there. And that's well done. Uh, Tee shot eight. of Swafford. Big par four here at 473 yards. Wofford's approach uh, from 167 is on the way at the sixth. It's a good one. Oh, go in. Fantastic. Inside of Haas there. I asked him if he and his father had been up there, and he said, yes. I said, did you play golf? He said, oh, no, we don't play golf. We go up there and shoot. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> a very nice rhythm and groove right now. Was aimed a little bit left there. Thought he was going to try to hit a little clip cut, and it just went flew dead straight. Good roll. Great effort there from Hudson. You get this thing 30 feet right. If you get any sort of draw, it's going to chase back to that hole. He's been really good today with his pace on the long putts. Look at this. And again, the big guy. Final tee shot of the day for Hudson Swafford. 392 yard par, four ninth. Finds the rough. This pins around the front. Looks like he went at that pretty hard to get some spin on it. Hold right there. Well, it's going to be a tricky little fast putt, but another quick little putt down the slope. Nice work. Pop that one in. Get on out of there. Solid 18 holes of work from Hudson Swafford. <laughs> 